Hey guys, this is Parker. Welcome to this week's AVA Rigs where we look at this awesome gaming PC with a Founders Edition 3090. Alright guys, so let's delve into this PC. Um, the whole thing is packaged up in a white 011 Dynamic by Lee & Lee. Um, super great case, we've talked about it a bunch on this channel, uh, it just holds everything you want. Obviously this one has nine fans in it and it comfortably fits all of them, so plenty of airflow. Um, the base of it is an X570 Tai Chi Razor Edition, so pretty similar to the normal Tai Chi board, except it's all Razor branded, so it looks super nice. Um, slapped into that board is a R9 5900X, uh, that's one of the Ryzen CPUs, pretty beefy CPU if you're looking to do um, workstation type stuff, as well as it runs all of the games you could ever think of. Um, it's got 64 gigs of RAM in it, it with these uh, Trident Z Royals, super beautiful RAM. I don't know why everybody doesn't buy one. Uh, these are the silver ones. I personally prefer the gold ones because I think they look cooler, but in this configuration with all the white components, it looks really nice. Um, Power Iron Graphical Department is this Founders Edition 3090. We've been getting a bunch of these in stock because we're super, you know, lucky during this whole shortage and everything. Um, pick one up if you can. They're super powerful. They look really awesome and they keep super cool. For cooling, we have an H150i Elite Capellix. Uh, that's from Corsair. Super good cooler. As you can see, it has a lot of RGB on it. It has a, the really nice lighting node core uh, controller that helps control your RGB, keeps your system cool and everything. Powering all this is a big old EVGA 1000 watt power supply. They're super great power supplies. We've had no problems with reliability on them so far that I've seen and it can do everything you want it to. Um, this customer picked out two terabytes of storage in an SSD format. Um, most people can tend to get about one to two terabytes. All right, guys. So this system also has a system binder like we've talked about before. Um, it tells you a lot about benchmarks and stuff for this particular system and gives you a little bit of a picture of how it compares to other things. Um, for our Geekbench score for this system, which is a CPU based test, uh, we got 13,536. Um, that's really high. The only thing that beats that out is the 5950X, which is the same CPU, just with more cores. Um, for 3 Mark, which is a combined CPU and GPU test, uh, overall got about 17,758, um, which is actually beating out the R9 5950X and 3080 configuration, probably due to the super high graphical score of the 3090. Um, for Luxmark, we came out with a score of 8,100. Uh, way higher than anything else. It's a GPU based test, so that 3090 is going to pretty much blow everything else out of the water. The next closest score would be the 3080 with 6,442. Hey guys, thanks for watching the video this week. Uh, leave a comment and subscribe, and let us know what you'd like to see in the future because we're super interested to hear from you. If you like the PC in this video, be sure to contact our sales team at sales at avadirect.com, or you can head over to our website by clicking on the link in the description below. You can choose from many pre-built options, gaming or workstation based, or use our configurator to build a PC of your dreams. Be sure to click that thumbs up button and subscribe, and don't forget to follow our social media channels at avadirect.com.